We're going to have the privilege in this service of having two of our young people, Timothy and Haley, give their testimonies and be baptized as their public profession of faith in Jesus Christ today. That's exciting, isn't it? Now, you know what to do. Let's, let's cheer them on as they share this. Well, we are so excited for these two, as we say, and as Pastor Pat just preached, we we're so excited to help people take this next step in their faith, and uh, so we're going to hear from them in a second. I just encourage you, as Pastor Pat was saying, if you are watching this baptism today, and, and God was speaking to you about any one of those things, or about taking the next step in your faith, about being baptized as well, uh, come talk to us after. Uh, but we want you to hear these testimonies. And we want you to hear specifically what God has been doing, the way that he's been working in these folks' lives, and the way that we hope that he continues to work. And as Pastor Pat says, we like to celebrate big uh, when, when folks are baptized. So in this room, if we can make it as loud as possible when this guy comes out of the water. In the multiplex, same thing. At home, open up your windows and scream outside or something, all right? Um, but Timothy, you want to just uh, walk us through how you came to know the Lord and how you came to be at this place. Yeah, before I um, turned to Jesus, there um, there wasn't much love. I didn't have a lot of love for one another, and I just felt angry very easily, and it was hard to forgive a lot. Then, um, through um, one of our Eastern Hills Easter services, I truly experienced the love of Jesus Christ and I knew that he has plans for me and I know that he alone holds my salvation and um, I started reading my Bible a lot more and I love Psalms 23 and Matthew chapter 5 through 7 chapters 5 through 7 I just feel encouraged and happy and overjoyed and I feel like the Holy Spirit is just rushing in my chest. Awesome. Well, we are so excited. Just a, a couple questions for you real quick. Have you accepted Jesus as your Lord and Savior? Yes. Awesome. And is it your de uh, desire to follow him all the days of your life? Yes. Awesome. Well, I am super pumped. Timothy, I baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. That was pretty good. I think we can be louder. All right, Haley, you want to tell us how you came to know the Lord? Yeah. My brother Timothy called me fat, ugly, gross, and disgusting. And um, he said, how could I get in trouble for t telling the truth and seeing facts? And he said it over and over again that I came to believe that. And I didn't want to be those words. I wanted to change. And I, and I thought nobody cared about me or like nobody wanted to be my friend or do anything with me. And I thought that nobody would want to do stuff with me. And then me and my mom did Bible study and she taught me who God says I am. And then we did TPM and God said I was a masterpiece, a work of art. and. He's still finishing in me. He's not finished with me yet, though. And I am a saint and a holy temple of God and a child of God. And oh, and that Timothy and the devil can't hurt me with those words again because that's not who God says I am. Awesome. Yeah. So cool. Haley, are you trusting Jesus with your, your whole life? Yes. yes. Is it your desire to follow him all the days of your life? Yes. Awesome. Haley, I baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. It's so 
so amazing, isn't it, to hear the ways that God can break down those lies in our lives. And so we're passionate about baptism. We're passionate about the Word of God. And so we just want to worship this service out and just offer all these things back to the Lord in song. So if you want to stand with us as we worship and, uh, and just offer all of these things to the Lord.